What is up YouTube? Ham Radio QSO here today. And today I'm going to work on my GMRS setup. I got my GMRS call sign yesterday. I'm WSDD 878. I bought a little cheap Redivus RA25 antenna. Or I should say radio. I left my old truck window down so I need to roll this up because it's been raining. And uh, I got an antenna off a friend of mine that I need to get up on the mast and check it out because the dual band vertical that I've been using for GM GMRS, it just, it just it just ain't working like it should be. There's a repeater that's 30 miles away. I can't get into it. Should be able to get into it because I'm putting 20 watts. So my guess is it is the antenna. So what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to take down this vertical put a connector on the antenna and uh, see what happens because I'm running KMR 400 cable so the KMR cable should be should be good enough for for that but uh, let me show you this antenna I'll show you what I'm using and what we're going to go to okay what you see there is the dual band vertical it's a tram it's 20 feet in the air and we're going to put this antenna on it. It is a GMRS antenna and it should make all the difference in the world. So let me get busy and get this done. I'll show you what it looks like when it's up and uh, we'll check out the radio and see what happens. Okay so I got this antenna down. So what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to use the mounting clamps on this. And you can see what I've done for an adapter here because that's an end connector and I don't have any so I just use some SMAs to get it over to mate with the coax. I don't think it'll be no big deal. Coax have to be on the outside but temporary setup it'll be fine. But let me get her get her done here. We've made some progress. It did fit inside the clamps of the old antenna. And this is my solution here adapted that's an end connector with the sma connectors to a so 2 unit 39 or pl whatever it is a choke and uh, all that good stuff now we just got to put her up then we can go inside you got her up there 20 foot off the ground next to my tower there so now we need to go in scan the gmrs bands and maybe try to get into repeater and see if it's an improvement over the tram antenna. It should be because this one, this antenna here starts at uh, 460, but your GMRS bands are in the 460 area, so should be a good improvement. Let's go check it out. Good afternoon. The time is 2 p.m. Okay, that is a repeater that is near Frankfort, Kentucky. It's in between Frankfort and Lexington. It's about 45 miles away from me. And this radio you see here is the Redivus RA25. It's G I bought the GMRS version, but you can unlock it to do 2 meter and 70 centimeter. But so far, it looks like it's been an improvement. But we'll sit here and uh, let it scan and see what we can hear. But I still have the uh, 2 meter and 70 centimeter frequencies programmed in here. It will pick up on those, but I'm not going to transmit. So we'll just put it in scan mode real quick and uh, see what happens. But if this antenna doesn't suit me, the gentleman that I got this one from has a big 24 foot uh, DB folded dipole antenna that's a monster. He priced it for a hundred bucks. It's a big, big antenna. It'd take a serious mount system to hold it. I know it'll work because it's a big commercial. But this antenna that I'm on now is a repeater antenna for GMRS, which only goes to serve that it should do better. But anyway, that's my project today. Oh, and by the way, I did get my other in-fed antenna up that I was building, and. Uh, We'll check it out real quick. We'll just go ahead and see what's on the HF side.
Man, no, 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 There's a polo station. But, yeah, you can see my ham radio setup is uh, coming along. You guys were here at the start when I started all this. Talking about HTs, the, you know, your handheld radios, your bow fans and stuff like that. But once you're in ham radio long enough, you will get to this point. The ham radio will take you any direction that you want to go in. But uh, if that's what I'm doing. I'm on summer break. I got two and a half months off. Probably more to come. I should have. I should have recorded the the in-fed antenna build up, but I didn't. I got busy. But uh, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Get yourself a license, and get on the air, and be ready to have fun. That's what radio is all about. Well, I'm gonna get out of here and uh, tinker around with the, this radio for a bit, and uh, hope to hear you on the air. 73s guys, KQ4 LPW.